let me say this before i get to the word so that it is on record um i want us to pray for donald trump in your secret place amen i had a vision this week about him and um I want us to pray for him. In the vision I was telling him, I was prophesying to him concerning what is to come. And I won't talk about that because you already know what it is. But then I was telling him to train his chief security officer very well because we should pray that there is no um, assassination attempt on his life both now and after the elections this is an NBC News special report here's Jose Diaz Balart good evening we are coming on the air with breaking news there has been an incident at Donald Trump's Pennsylvania rally it appears shots have apparently been fired and Donald Trump has been injured I'm going to pause to let you see the video as it played out. That chart, that chart's a couple of months old, and if you uh, want to really see something that said, take a look at what happened. Oh. So here's what we know at this hour. What sounds like shots rang out. The former president grabbed his ear and as he fell was immediately surrounded by security behind the podium. And as you can see in these images, he was shortly rushed off the stage. This is an emerging situation. NBC's Dasha Burns is at that Trump rally north of Pittsburgh and joins us now. Dasha, what do we know? Jose, we're still waiting to confirm a lot of the details here. A lot of question marks still up in the air. Here's what I can tell you from my vantage point, because I was standing right here uh, as Trump first came onto the stage. He was just a few minutes into his speech at this rally. I was in front of a camera, and I was walking off of the press risers here uh, down below to the ground level where all of the uh, general attendants are as we heard what sounded like gunshots ring out. Out. My producer and I uh, ran to take cover, as did um, se several of the people that are in attendance here, most people ducking down uh, the press that were behind the Riser Express that were at our media tables, ducking down under the tables as we weren't sure uh, what was going on. Our crew, who was up on the stage, uh, captured some of that video that you showed, the former president uh, getting uh, protected by his Secret Service. Uh, they covered him. He looked to have some blood on his face. It looked like his ear uh, was bloody. A lot of chaos and confusion. No one was sure where the gunshots uh, that were sounded like gunshots uh, were coming from. The former president, as we know, is now uh, inside the motorcade. He may at this point be off site. The folks here are now evacuating a lot of confusion, some anger, people yelling at the press here, not sure what you, uh, to make of what has just happened. The former president was just uh, standing on the stage. He was talking about immigration under President Biden when all of this erupted into chaos. Again, just moments into his appearance here in Butler, uh, Pennsylvania. So far, we're safe. Our crew is safe. We have not seen anyone uh, injured. We have not heard of anyone injured yet, but certainly uh, unexpected, uh, confusing, and we are still waiting to find out what exactly transpired here, Jose? Thanks for watching. Amen. When is the elections? American election. November. This is what? February. So it's good that it's set now. So let's pray for him. Those of you who love him, pray for him. Um, 
that there will be no assassination attempt amen a lot of things will change in america this year yes the election is going to be one of its kind amen so during the year if god says anything i will just bring the updates to you so that you are aware amen all right let's get to the word activating rest this is the final part of this uh, series 